What's going on, guys? T Mart here, and welcome back. Gear showcases, which, as you'd expect, contain many facts and lots of sensible advice, such as how to play ten pin bowling without leaving the car, and if you've ever wanted to set a lap time on the Top Gear test track in some of the fastest cars ever to lap it. Well, it's your lucky day. Here we go, boys. We just unlocked the Top Gear bowling event in a Jaguar F-Type. So here we go. And knock down as many pins as possible in the Jaguar F-Type on a rainy Top Gear test track. This sounds pretty insane. I'm actually really excited for this. The Top Gear test track, home of the world famous Top Gear television program. All right. What else could be said? Who doesn't love Top Gear? I miss it so much. But anyway, yeah, so here we go, boys. We are going to be knocking down some bowling pins in a Jaguar F-Type. Whew. Man, this is going to be fun. Bowling in a car. That's pretty cool. Actually, I, I'm in a bowling league right now, like a Monday night. It's average Joe's bowling. It's just basically an excuse to, like, hang out with friends and, uh, you know, drink some beer and, and have fun. But uh, car bowling is a deceptively simple idea. In fact, it's pretty much like normal bowling, but without the slippery floor and ugly shoes. <laughs> We've positioned some bowling pins around the Top Gear track. It's your job to knock them down by driving around as sideways as possible with lots of smoke pouring off your tires. Okay. Sounds good to me. I was going to say, yeah, I'm used to throwing, like, <clears throat> greasy, oily bowling balls. That's what she said, but uh, not in the car. So we're going to see. Ooh, look at all these fans out here just for me. All these people are here just to watch me. All right, so we're gonna try this a couple of different times. I've got a feeling outside of the car is gonna be the easiest. All right, so I see, do we want white pins or? Hold on. What are the, I think the orange pins are bad. Plus 700? Plus 300? I don't get it. Which ones do we want, white or orange, or does it matter? Oh, dude, this is gonna be fun. All right, we've gotta restart it. I, I can't tell if white or orange is better. Car That's what I was trying to do right there. So we're gonna see, uh, let's see what we can do. If I was to guess, I would say orange would be better, but maybe it doesn't matter. Oh gosh, hydroplane. Oh, man. That was a bad start. Holy cow, that's like deep water right there, dude. That Car sent us far off into the left. All right, we're gonna try this again. So let's let's do a lap on the the outer view, and then we're gonna do a lap on the inner view. So we're gonna stay away from that water. We're gonna come across this way. Oh yeah. Oh, yes, that felt good. Does time matter? Or is there like a... Is there like a bonus score? Should we just sit here and just do donuts or what? Uh, I don't think it counts if you go backwards or if you're going slow. Jump that hydroplane. Oh, gosh. This is harder than you would think. Oh, get a strike! We got a strike! Let's go, boys! We got a strike! Let's go! On our, oh, oh, no, there was one left standing. Screw you! Alright, we're gonna get a strike on the next one. No, we aren't. It's not set up right. Oh, that's a son of a gun, dude. I wanted the strike. I wanted the strike so bad. All right, here we go. We need the point facing towards us. Got many strikes there. This is difficult, dude. Gotta learn our line. We're gonna try to get the strike when we come back in and uh... Do it in first person. 
All right, 197,700, let's see what that's worth. 2,750 credits. That's all that's worth? Seriously? Holy cow, all right, we're gonna try this again. We're gonna do it one more time from inside the vehicle. Let's see, uh, what was it, 197,000? How do I already forget? I don't know. All right, I think it was 197,000. So we're gonna try it from inside. Let's do it, boys. First person bowling in an F-Type. I wonder if you get more speed for going fast. I would assume that's how it works. Thousand for that. That wasn't bad. All right, let's get back up. Here we go. Probably could have gotten sideways a little bit earlier there, but that's all right. Oh, our objective is two hundred twenty-eight thousand. I didn't even see that last time, so that's why we didn't get much scores because we didn't do all that well. I don't think it's necessarily about speed. This is hard to see. Strike. Strike! Do we get it? I think we got it. Oh my gosh, these pins are always left standing. Back up a little bit here. I don't think speed matters, so I think as long as we're going fast enough, we can like back up and do stuff like this for me. 2,400 for that. Maybe 300 score for that? Alright, we're gonna back it up and see if we can get that bowling pin off of me. That one didn't count. I don't know how they're counting this. Oh, it just turned us around. I remember this one. Come over here. Go along the whole route of them. Oh, yes. 229. Oh my gosh, we beat it by 1,100. We had a nice little combo there at the end. There are a few left, though. We, we got it, boys. Now we're actually going to be able to get some... some reward. 241,000. All right, we were able to beat it from inside the car. That's good stuff. New badges unlocked. Good, good stuff there. 45... Still didn't get many credits for that one, though. That one really wasn't worth... wasn't worth all that much. That's all right. Uh-oh. F-Type versus the Stig. We unlocked that. Might have to, uh, we'll probably do like a, a Stig, um, a Stig episode in the future. So yeah, there you guys have it. That's Bowling with the Jaguar F-Type. Hope you guys enjoyed. We're gonna hop back into our career in the next episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys there. Peace out. Just kidding, guys. Here we go. We are gonna be racing the Stig 1v1 in a Jaguar F-Type here Some at say Rio. De Janeiro. I'm so I just I, I totally totally interrupted that guy. All I was gonna do is blow smoke up the Stig's ass. He was just he was just gonna hype him up and it's cool because the Stig's about to lose. Like he's he's gonna get smoked right here. So let's see uh let's see it, buddy. Let's see what you got. Here we go. So it looks like we have two laps to get this done. Seems like his car is a little bit faster up the start here. Up. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? You're the st you're the the almighty Stig, the mystery man behind the wheel, and you're just gonna get smoked like that, dude. I'm hoping we're gonna get a ton of points for beating the Stig. We're gonna up the difficulty after this one. I was honestly a little bit nervous. I thought the the Stig races were gonna be like super super hardcore. You know what I mean? Like he's been he's a badass, obviously. I don't think it's going to let us pull too far ahead of him, though. Like, I think it, I think he's going to keep up with us. We're going to have to race a good race. Just hit the 
the wall a little bit there. I don't see any damage in the car though, so we're alright. Oh yeah, he's right on us, dude. I was gonna say, there's no way we beat the stick that bad. He's gonna be right on our butt the entire time. They wouldn't let the stick lose badly. He's right there. Driving perfection right there on that guy. Last time we were here, we completely trashed an Audi R8 and I still feel kind of bad about it. Nice! Woo! I thought I was a little bit nervous there. I thought we might be going to the wall, but. I think we got him! Unless we make any royal mistakes, I'm pretty sure we got them. And this is a clean race, man. We skipped the wall a little bit on the first lap, but there's no physical damage to the car. Technically, there probably should be, but I think we might, might come out with a clean car here. Yeah, there's no damage here. Oh, yeah, there is actually on the door. You guys see that? Darn it. I screwed up. We could have had a perfect race. It's nice racing 1v1. I like not dealing with a whole group of cars, especially at the beginning of getting these races. Just, I feel like it's a motocross race where everybody's falling over and running into each other trying to get the whole shot. Look at him trying to make some moves here at the end. Unfortunately for the Stig, I believe it's going to be too little too late. That big old plane flying in right there. That was kind of cool. Yeah. We got him, boys. Good stuff. Not hitting the brakes at all. Woo! There it is. What are we going to get for beating the Stig? That's what I want to know. We beat him by a couple of seconds, too. That was pretty good. Let's see here. 19,000 credits. Some driver XP. Level up the Jaguar Affinity. I like it. Cool. All right, well, boys, we're going to head back to our uh, our actual career for real this time. And in the next episode, we're going to be hopping in a Ferrari 458 Italia Speciale. So uh, that's going to be uh, pretty exciting. I'll see you guys there. Thanks for watching. Peace out.